Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play War Tales. I'm your host, Colors Fade, and it's episode 55. So we're in this battle right next to the jail. Conveniently, right next to the jail, we want to try and capture three people. So, we have to get set up here, and we have some hired killers, which is great. Uh, these two groups were fighting each other, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six. We have a group of six over here. We have a group of six over here with two archers. And then we have a group of six over here. Okay. What I want to do, these guys right here have no archers. So I want them to have bears to fight against. So Silvio's going to be there. And Holly Walnuts is going to be here. And Adrienne is going to be here. I'm going to move their guys around like this. Crewmate. Kira's going to have a chance to shoot in there and take those guys on. Over here, these guys have no archers either. So, that's good. Bears. Bears is great. We want bears. Bears. We got Olgierd and Manus. I'd really like to have a big chonker over there. So, let's see. Yep, Jadruk can come over here and he can take this place. I've got Jenna and I need one archer over there. So there's Greet. Greet can swap with like that. So here is Gideon. So now what we gotta do is get a group set up over here. And this has got to be this is where we want Manus and Gideon because we want people who can run through here and get these archers. So there's Pete. Manus, Dreyus, you guys up front. We got Harim. Harim needs to be over in this group. We got two bears over here. Let's do this. Silvio's over here. Polly's over here. I got a merchant who I want to stay really far away. And another merchant who I want to stay really far away. And a hired killer right here. So let's do that. And you can go over there. You can be here. I like this. Leo Hall. Kira's going to have a chance to shoot into this group. Alana needs to be in a position to grab Valor points, which she could do over here. Do we have a stabber over here? Xenia, Gideon. Yeah, we have Dreyus over here. I'd like. What do I have? Harim. Oh yeah, I was saying, let's put Harim up here. Kira's here to shoot at these bozos. Are they all going to come this direction? I don't think so. But these guys are. These guys are not going to be running in that direction. They're going to come here. So we're going to leave her here. So this is how we're going to start it. Um, We have full valor points. So really the first thing we should do... Just move this guy up here. He's going to take a shot at him. And really. Yeah, this is this is the best. Just go like that. Use two points up right away to do that. They're going to get two to go. One of them's probably going to be an archer. That's fine. That's great. He earns a point back. Oh, it's not going to be an archer. Miracle of miracles. And he's going to engage a bear, which is going to be great. Okay. In that case, we will take Gideon and race him up here. He earns a point, but he can't hit both of them like that. That's too bad. Okay, so we're just going to leave him there. Smack the bear. That's what you should do. Definitely smack that bear. So we just have to remember that we want to try and capture three guys. And you can't capture the dudes with the stars over their heads. That's the part that, again, from last episode, I just didn't know. So... Pete's over here. He's going to run over here and engage this other guy. There's three archers over here. Man, that sucks. 
Okay. That gets that one engaged. He's going to run up there and engage that bear. Very nice. Which is going to free us to do... I can't really do what I want to over here unless we can kill that guy. And he's got 211 guard. Xenia can do it, though. She's got wrath. Let's see if she can get over here and do this. So what do I have to do here? Trigger damages to the target that have level less than 50% health. Okay, so that's the tricky part. Less than 50% health. Okay. They're bleeding. And then I wanted to do this. They're engaged. I don't necessarily need to spend that point, but killing them would be great. Then she can swoop around and help kill these other two guys next time. And now I need to start worrying about this group because they're going to... Okay, he's going to stab the bear, which is great. I didn't want him to get my archer because now my archer is out of the way. Okay, this would be kind of safe. Can you... Oh, you'd kill him. What about this? Okay, here we go. He's not dead. Capture. 57% rate. Failed. We missed. Okay. In that case, I'm going to go up here and grab this guy. I can't capture him. And I'm just going to taunt him. I don't want him to do anything else. I don't want him to set up or anything. Wow, he did crit on both of them. Nice. Trying to hurt my bear, eh? Okay. In that case, these guys haven't had a lot of time to go. Really want to take care of this situation. I want to capture this guy. So Jenna is going to roll on in here. Try to capture this guy and kill that guy. She got it. There's one. Okay, now you need to move up here. That's as good as she can do. Okay. Uh-oh, the bowman is free. The bowman is free. It's gonna circle around and hit everybody. Oh my gosh, okay. That was chunky. Well, that put Leo in perfect position to do this. Because he's got the same kind of thing. That's nice. Now what I can do is move up here kind of out of the way. He's going to go after the bear, right? Nope, he's going to come up here. Son of a bitch. Oh, you bastard. <gasps> he hit his own guy, though. That's great. Okay, Kira. It's time for you to get involved. I don't care who you hit here. Yep, make him bleed. Make him hurt. Okay, you, my friend. He's not bleeding. Let's make him bleed. And then we can do a little of this. Oh, 
Oh, it's a stab. And a bleed. Oh man, if we can get somebody around, we can capture that one. Tonk. He's a non-capture. I would like to heal my bear. Let's do that. First, let's heal the bear. And let's move. I don't want to get poisoned, so I'm just going to go like this. This is not my guy. He's one of the mercenaries. I don't want him to die, but I don't care if he does. So what do I have down here? I have Dratus, and he hasn't gone. We need to get him up here and get this guy. Capture number two? Nope, he missed. Son of a gun. That stinks. But I'll do this then. Archer goes down, but I'm more concerned with this guy. Yeah, he takes a beating. Great. Get out of the way. What are you guys doing? You should stay out of the way. Dodge? Yeah, good. I got a whole bunch of bears that are going to go soon. This is ugly. Okay, this is Alana, and she needs to earn a bunch of points. Here. But she needs actually Harim's Valor before she does it. So... What do we want her to do? This guy is an AOE guy. And now she's fighting him. I don't really want that to be the situation, but... There we go. Oh, and he got poisoned again. I just healed him. Son of a gun. Everybody's got poison now. So Harim is saying he's right next. Yeah, here we go. Get out of my, get out of the way. Get that off the screen. Okay, you're gonna poke this one. There, get it off of her. Get off of her. Please tell me you're gonna eat this guy here. Engage him. That'd be great. They're going to stay there and guard. Hurt him. Hurt him a lot. Okay, perfect. He's got a star over his face, though, so you just need to kill him. All right. He's got a star, so we can't kill him. This, These two guys here have stars. We can't kill them. I mean, can't capture them. So, down here. This guy's bleeding... I would like to get both of these. Xenia, we can we can take two guys out here. She earns valor points every time she hits somebody twice. Can you hit everybody in a circle? Not quite. Go like this. In that case, I want her to go like this and taunt this bastard. <laughs> yep, and the archer would have gone next. Hmm. Okay. I don't need this guy doing damage to two people over here. 
So Pete, I want you to just smack this guy and engage him. Get him started. There we go. I'm gonna poke my bear. Gideon try to do this. 52%. Can this be second guy? Second guy's down. Okay, that's nice. In that case, come over here and get ready to smack that guy or just support him. My bears. Leave my bears alone. Okay, Harim is right here, and I need him to do tactical order on everybody there. And then he's going to move next to the bear, and he's going to poke this guy. gonna get eight for this eight valor points doink that's awesome she can help grab this guy 57% she missed him so what I should have her do she missed him that's a shame but I have her go over here and hmm, all three of these guys are tied up and I kind of want to keep them that way Let's go heal this bear. That bear needs to be healed. Jesus, my bears. And yeah, that person's dead. Uh, it's a little more risky when you're trying to capture people, so... What do we really want to do here? That bear needs to get out of that poison field. Is it is it a poison field or is it just the bear? Cause I think it's a little field there. He's probably going to die. Let's do this. I could spend two points and eviscerate you. And then I can move around. I can heal this guy. And then I can move over here and hit him. And I can get wrath on that by killing that one. Which is going to make it more devastating when I can finally get around to killing somebody else. Like one of these guys over here. All star guys, so we just need to kill the hell out of them. Oh, the the triple retaliation, that's awesome. Okay, the thing to do here with you. What's he got for strength? 69? He's a level 10? I got level 8 guys. Okay. Still crit him. That was nice. In that case, you get over here and finish him off. Oh, come on, sister. She's 69, Mr. 69. Now she's going to run over here, and along with Old Gear, they both have Wrath set up. They're going to go destroy things over in this direction. Son of a gun. 
Who is this? Leo Hall? Uh, Leo, can you capture this guy? So if you can't, you're just going to have to kill him. You missed him before. And you missed him again. Okay. Well then, there's nothing you can do. There's nothing else you can do except that. That's pretty good. So stay right there. Try not to die. You guys could come over and heal me. That'd be great. And I'll just move you over here. He's not doing a lot of damage to that guy. This bear says, uh, I want to hurt somebody. I want to beat the crap out of somebody. Yeah, I got a bear over there. That's great. He's got that guy engaged. He's barely got any hit points. That might be our third captive. I hate how the game does this. It moves to the character it thinks you want to go next, and then it gets stuck there for a little bit. So what do we have here? Harim, you've gone. You've gone. Okay, who's down here that can go get this guy? Nobody. Oh, can you heal that bear? in a green mist of poison field so when he moves he's still gonna get poisoned nope he's not good okay now he's gonna kill this guy I was wanted to capture him darn it I want to capture this guy too and he's gonna kill that one uh, it's probably for the best they're down to five we still got chances here to get a third capture still got chances okay this guy's a possibility nope he's dead Down to four. That bear says, I'm going to go smack this guy. He does not have a star over his head. So he's a possibility. Okay, can you capture this guy? All you gotta do is be next to him. Doesn't matter. You don't have to be behind. Try 55%. Okay, that's our third one. Oh, good. It's a payday. Unlocked. Tyrannical? What's that do? Willpower increased by two as long as there are prisoners in the troop. Oh, that's... That's badass. Okay, come over here and... You got no more stabbies? All right. Everybody, just kill now. Just kill. Oh, just kill so I can get all my bears to survive here. Gratis? I think you need to be directly behind him for some of this. Be extra nasty here. Oh, that's wicked. What a wicked thing we play. We are galvanized. Okay. Two guys left. Where are they? There's this loser here, and who else? Who's their other loser? This guy right here. We need to engage him. So, Leo, you don't have a lot going on here, buddy. I need somebody who can get this guy. Can Old Gear get to him? Yep. Okay, get up here. This is it, bud. In fact, scooch just a little bit like this. 
So we can fire off that first engaging. And then when we fire this, it's at an angle that won't hit our friends. And then we can just wrath you. It's done. All right, now we're down to this bozo. He's the last one. Let's go with Alana. Unless Jenna had wrath. Can she get over there? There's Greet and there's Jenna. Can Jenna get over there? Nope. Okay. It's going to have to be Alana. She can do it. I don't want this guy hitting me. Okay, it's a good poke. Try to get out of the way a little bit there. And he finished it off without hitting us. That's nice. Okay. Loot all. Grab the corpse. This is going to make us really heavy. 874. Okay. Everyone. Oh my gosh. Lots of repairs. Pete. Olgian on Everett. Yeah, and so if anybody's asking why don't I just use the repair all button, it, it's simply because I find it to be wasteful. Like here, like if, if this says 75 out of 76, it's still going to use a repair tool for two points, and I just don't think that's cool. We're down to 42, but I have a bunch stored at Maran, so... I need to get over there, and that's why we're going to do trade stuff. So Meadow took a wound. We probably need to make some more healing stuff. How many remedies do we have? We don't have a cure for the plague, flawed remedy, and medicine. Yeah, we're going to need to make some more soon. Tony Soprano. Now, what's the flawed remedy do? I'm curious about that. What's the difference? Kira made a level, an aptitude point. We can give her movement or critical hit if we career plans her. So let's career plans her because her having more crits is great. And then we're going to continue on. So we got three prisoners, these guys. What Now, do you guys... Might I interest you in my yeah. humble wares, my good sirs? That and the wolf and the beer? Hell yeah. Okay, let's turn these guys in. I am legally obligated to give. And over the prison. And over the... But, sorry, but we can't take any more prisoners? Oh, you gotta be joking me. Oh, that's hilarious. Okay, we gotta go to a different prison. To turn these bozos in. Well, we're gonna leave Ludern then. Bat Claw Cave? What the hell is this? Did I miss this before? Bears don't look too pleased to see you. We'll, we'll grab those bears later. I don't want to have to feed them right now. That's funny. I've totally missed that the whole time. Well, alrighty then. We are going to head to Maron. Actually, do we want to go to Maron? There's a ghost pack. Oh, do I want to have to fight the ghost pack? I could use some more of the ghostly stuff. Yeah, we're going to have to fight him. We couldn't run past him. We tried. So in that case, there's 10. So there's going to be 5 and 5. All right. Let's make this easy then. We got bears. Alana. Jenna. Oh my god, I have a whole bunch of stabbies over here. Okay, let's do this. Two bears, two bears, and a bear over here. That means... What's this? Ghost boar, ghost wolf, ghost boar. Okay. You want to get these ghost boars wrapped up as fast as possible. I think I want Kira up here. Manus, 
bear, bear. What about this? What am I what am I looking at? I'm looking at a boar here. A boar here. I need to get these wrapped up. So Chadru, come over here and wrap that boar up. Bull geared. There's no how many boars do I have? I have that one. Pete to wrap up a boar, Gideon to wrap up a boar. I need old geared. I've got Jadruk to wrap up that boar, and I need old geared over here to wrap up this boar. Okay, we don't know what order the boards are the boars are gonna go in, but that's what we gotta do. So let's start with the old gear. Just wrap up the boars, buddy. That's all we can do. There goes a wolf first, which is great. Give me control, buddy. There's a boar. I just want to earn a bunch of points. You can kill those guys by hitting that repost there, but I'm not concerned about it. Not yet, because what I really want to do is get these boars wrapped up so they just do minimal amount of armor damage. Because they'll run through you, and it just stinks. They'll run through your whole party and hit everybody and do armor damage to them. There we go. That's the way. Uh-huh, uh-huh, we like it. Hey, there's one more boar over here. Jadruk. How many it's strength? Okay, so you're going to crit it no matter what. There we go. So why don't you do this and earn wrath? And then Ghost Wolf, Ghost Wolf, Ghost Wolf. You can do this guy and hit him with this. He'll be weakened and wrath. And you kill him. That's nice. So move like that. Move like Jagger. Smack. The smackdown's coming. Okay, we're here. Let's move this person right here. Shoot this one. Perfect. And then if any of them want to go in this direction, you can move right up here and say... Oh, and then make your bear a little tougher, Tony. Tony the bear. And just say, yeah, don't come this way. Adriana is going to come over here and kill this boar. Oh, really close. Thought she was going to kill it. Greet. Nice, she gets to shoot again because it's a crit. I've got her bow and her equipment set up to where she's trying to get as many crits as she can, so. This would be good. Then we're going to come really close to killing this all on first turn. That would be nice. So there goes that one. In which case, you. I have you and then I have who else? Leo Hall. Hmm. Great. That one's crit and done. Silvio. Gonna kill himself a log or a wolf. Nice. Harim. Knock that guy like that. Might as well spend the points to do this. Because they're temporary valor points, so you can't take them with you. Is the bear gonna get, does it get retaliation off that? It doesn't. In that case, Alana. 
You can earn a few points. Cancel. No, no, no. Go this way. How many points can you can you get? Uh, you can only get like three, can't you? Okay. Oh, I know what I should be doing. Okay, hold on. Let's go over here and stab this one. And then we're going to toss smoke screen here. So the bear can finish off that pig. Okay, that's nice. So that's that. You're going to run right up here. Jenna, do you want to spend two points to do Frenzy? Yeah, because you can kill on that one. You can't quite get back here, though, can you? So toss this. And it can bleed. It's going to be left up to Dratus. Can he do it? Probably not, because he can't get in close enough to that guy. Son of a gun. Well, he can wrath that guy. And then he can move in a little bit and maybe he can do this. There we go. That was the first turn that we were looking for. Shouldn't be anybody that needs repaired. Too bad. You could use a little 25 points. Perfect. Let's continue on. We're going to roll right on through here. And in order to do the whole loop, we really need to start in the county of Artes. So we'll head on over to Strong Camp. Run through the forest here. Tiltrin County. We'll have to make a little deviation here. We want to roll on up this way. Take the shortcut. Because there is the jail. Come on now, come on. Let's fish while we're here. Journeyman. Now, what I don't know is how do you change fish hooks? How do you change fish hooks? Because we have different fish hooks. We have expert fish hook. What is this? That's f We have seven of those and then we have seven of these and it just lists them all right there. Okay, interesting. So I'm not sure how you change fish hooks. Maybe you just have to use the cheap fish hooks first. This one use an expert first. Okay, so it's going to use your best fish hooks first. And that gets you plus fish for that, which is really nice. There we go. That's nice. All right, let's go drop these bozos off then. The Lady Mayoness has offered a reward for any outlaw captured toothpaste in the Toothpaste teaches you, you how to cook give toothpaste. Bounty hunting a try. Wow, really? That's, that's interesting. You have to spend a coal, a snow iris, a hemp, and a grease on toothpaste, and it counts as one food? Doesn't seem worth it. Thanks for contributing to, to thanks law for and order. To law and order. I can't get over the way she says contributing. It's not contributing. It's contributing. It must be. I think somebody said thanks in a previous comment in the series that that's an English thing order. or a Welsh thing or something. It's a. 
They're like, you damn Americans, the way you pronounce everything. It's aluminium, not aluminum. Where did you get that extra letter at, bud? Uh, okay. Those guys did good. We're gonna have to rest soon. Almost need another pony here. But resting is gonna allow us to eat some carcasses, so. Yep. Okay, let's just rest right here. So over here in Beehive Land, all these flowers that you pick, it's great. Oh, and what do we have here? We got a pony that leveled up. Bart leveled up. He's got another level. We can give him movement or constitution. Yeah, baby. Okay, Bart. Oh, and what's he... More? Why does it say he still needs a level? Plane Runner. Oh, so we have to check this. This is the only thing he can have because he's not a war pony. Carrying capacity increased by five and we're a little faster. All right. Way to go, Bart. So over here, a bunch of stuff you can do. Um, I don't think you can take the honey, but I'd rather use it in meals. So I don't think I'm going to do anything with this for tonight. So he, Pete, is going to sit over here, our journeyman angler, and enjoy an evening by the fire. Xenia is going to enjoy an evening by the fire. You're going to do that. It's the last. Oh, and we have, we now have the ghost ones. We have three of those. Okay. We have the tinkerer. We have food. Is there anything else that you can make? There's a bunch of stuff here. Oh my goodness. Beer infused wolf robes. Please. Yep. Because we bought that stuff. Mutton stew. Get low on salt. We're gonna have to. We're gonna buy some when we stop in town. So for now, and there's why I like to save the milk and honey. We use that for porridge. See, we got 15 days of food. You can see how panicked I am about food. It's just me. And then there's a culture shock worth 40. So I'm going to try to save the big meals, like the Hill Delight, which gives you a dexterity increase of 25%. Reduces the speed at which the troops fatigue stacks by 50% until the next rest, though. I actually do want to use that. I want to get as far as I can in this trade loop because the bears are expensive. So I'm going to get rid of the corpses because they're heavy. We're going to use one of those. And then the rest of it should be this. Bonus maximum valor points. Don't care about that. Don't care about that. Let's really grab these. Birch broth. Pay the group. And my hungry bears. We got some mushrooms down here, I know. And a little bit of cider for everybody. That sounds actually really good. I'd like to have some cider right about now. That'd be awesome. And Kira's going to say what? Just a little more effort. I'll make a name for myself. Even the Legion will want to hire me. Teach. She gains 24, 264 experience with close companions. Or she just gets 264 XP. I'd rather close companions. Or you can give her an aptitude point. Um, okay. Aptitude point? Sure, show off. What do you get for that aptitude point here? We can do dexterity. Okay, dexterity or critical hit. What would we rather have? Let's do dex. She's up to 68. That's awesome. A lot of that's in gear, of course. So, Tilton County is like the midpoint of this loop. We're not actually starting the real loop yet, but that's okay. This is going to allow us to pick up some stuff. And to get rid of a few things. So in the Apothecary's Clinic, we're just going to do a standard town thing here where we kind of take our time and get this stuff. We got a bunch more rim steel if we want to make it. We got medicine. We got angry cats in the background. 
What's the rat bait for? What does this do? You can pour the soil on a rat's nest to rebuild it in eight hours, but who would do such a thing? You would do that if you want the plague ridden stuff. So the in order to make the pristine essence, you need plague ridden samples. And I did a couple of rat's nests so I could get some more. You need the plague ridden samples so that you can make the rhyme steel. Um, actually, no, you don't need it for that. You need it for something. I can't remember what you need it for. I think it's used during smithing though is when you need uh, the, the pristine essence. But anyway, you do need it. Oh, no, it's for this. Okay, it's for all this stuff. So, plague essence oil dealt to plague units increased by 25%. Yeah, would be nice, but... So, anyway, there's all our, our oils. What we're going to do is hit the forge. You can use my anvil. Those are cheap I can also this time. That's great. Armor. This weapon I'm not going to hang on to. I, if it had a lot more strength, I'd use it. I really like what it says on it. It is, uh, this attack always activates the oil applied to it. That's fantastic, but it's, it doesn't have enough strength to warrant it in my opinion. So, and I can a few touch up everybody's stuff for 24 Nothing gold. More. So that's good. And then the big thing is we're going to go to the market after the feast in here. We're going to go here and Might turn our stuff in. For work? Here is your reward. There's our bounties. Now, you before you go run your trade route, you always want to make sure that there's not an inform quest that you can do. Um, the trade one we won't, can't do because it's a different reason. Assassinate the group. This is going north of where we're, we're located at right now, and we don't want to do that. But pay attention to these directions because when you're going to do a trade route, you can get some really cheap... Uh, cash along the way so what I like to do this is to the bottom right of us which is not ideal uh, it's to the south east which is not really the direction we're going so I'm, I'm not I'm gonna leave that alone while you're here oh, you can always sing now that I have uh, the loot I'll buy that for 30 so here it is we have a bard he's experienced now and it's you know the standard thing Guitar Hero. I don't know. There's a guitar program that'll teach people to play the real guitar using a Guitar Hero thing like that. And I don't know how anybody learns the guitar that way. I honestly don't, because as a musician, I don't imagine the notes coming at me like that. That's really awkward to me <laughs> to see that. As a real musician, that freaks me out. But it works for some people. So, hey, whatever it takes to get it to play, man. I'd like to see more musicians in the world. That'd be awesome. We're going to go to the Three Hairs Market. We need salt. You touch it, you buy it. We're gonna buy the salt, we're gonna buy the grapes. We need all this stuff here for meals that we're gonna make. Those refugees. I understand there's a war in Edoran, but that doesn't mean they can just help themselves. So we're gonna to talk to everybody Don't you mostly because me? yeah, she's got I was begging in milk, the streets this not so long ago. Cheese. So we spend quite a bit of money buying those things, but then we come. Come, here. come! Take a look at my wares to buy his hemp now we want to buy his amber for 45 this is great we're gonna buy his pottery for 67 um the woolen claw where do i sell that at? i have a, i have an excel spreadsheet i'll have to share that with everybody here um the woolen claw where is that going the wool is gonna if we were going back to Ludern, we would pick up the wool because you can sell the wool in Ludern for about twice as much. We're not gonna do that here, so we're just gonna grab that and leave. So that's this is the midpoint. This is not actually how the whole loop starts, but we'll get there. Oh no, oh, go, we gotta get me these there's gold one right there. What luck was that? Stand back, peasants. These valuable commodities are only for those who can afford them. He's got beans. Beans, beans, musical fruit. But this is what we want is the great clusters. So. And he's got brandy. Don't care so much about that. Okay. So 
you want to go out this side of Stromcat. Because this is actually a shortcut. This is where you want to go is in this direction. We could go do this Vanquish thing pretty easy, but we're going to skip it for now. I got about 10 minutes left in this episode. So next episode is where we'll do the whole entire thing from start to finish, even with these bears. We'll show you the loop. It's it's not so much a loop. It's a loop is a wrong word. We're going to go in one direction and then circle back in exactly the same direction. So like I said, we're going to start here at Cortia, work our way all the way up here to Marheim. It takes you about a day to do this and then come back down through here and end at the Brotherhood. And you'll be able to dump a bunch of goods and you'll be able to make quite a bit of money doing it. And that's how I got this far. Like I said, I want to put up the trading post things, the whatever they're called things that allow you to fast travel basically i believe i believe that's what they're supposed to let you do is fast travel which would make this loop even more ridiculously awesome but i could be wrong about that fast traveling thing and so that's why if you have one of those big meals that are worth 40 food and you don't have bears if you don't have the bears your food is going to be somewhere around 100 for this kind of group with all these ponies. As opposed to, you know, like 140 or whatever. Um, mine might have even been like 79 or something like that. It wasn't a lot of food. So you can spend 40 on that so that they, they don't fatigue as fast. So we're going to grab, let's see, Peter's Market... We're going to talk to this oh, guy. Oh, I don't believe a word she says. She probably came across a band of deserters. They've We're going to grab the pelts. In these parts since, oh, since the beginning of the war. We're going to want these. We're going to grab all of those. And we want the gems, which are being bought for 90. And we're going to sell them for uh, a pretty good markup. Let's see where the gems. These are gonna, So the gems are the one part we're going to sell in Stromcap. And all we're going to do is here is punch. buy salt. The war drags on. And Lahart and Vinalis. So we bought that. We're going we're gonna to sell the gems. And now we're overweight, which is the stinky part. You bears, how far overweight are we? Okay, we're overweight by quite a bit. So when we're overweight, this is what I do. Now you can get away with having more bears. I'm just going to set this up. We're not actually going to camp. So what we're going to do is cook because a lot of... Oh, what is this? Kira. What? What is this? What? What is this thing? What is this? Haystack. January blank blank during the rest of Pony Ascent of this will not consume any other food. Oh, nice. Okay. Well, we're not going to be doing that. All we're concerned about is cooking. A lot of times by cooking, you can combine things and take weight away. So we got a bunch of salt here. And we're going to see if we can get our weight down to 968. Probably not, but we're going to try. Sometimes it'll go up. There it went down. It's 996. Eel soup. Oh, you want the cabbage. Apple pancakes. We don't have a lot of wheat. That's what we're missing. For more of those. And the potage, which we're missing milk for. Okay. So how are we doing now? We're down to 972. We're still not there. Okay. We can do perch broth. It's down to 972. Medium rare mutton. Venison skewers. Pike soup. Let's try that. Nine sixty nine and nine sixty eight. <laughs> so we can make a couple more perch broths. Maybe this will be enough. 
there we go we're at 967.8 so that's that's one way to do that is to make a whole bunch of food and then you can get your weight down I have more than enough food here. 16 days. I, I really shouldn't be buying anything for a while. So we're going to go back up to Strom Camp. We're going to sell the gems. Then we're going to go up to Marheim and buy some more stuff. Come back through Strom Camp. Pick up any more new supplies that they have. Because it takes a little bit of time to regenerate. Like Strom Camp will probably have a couple of supplies. New supplies. Whatever we bought before. It'll have like one or two of those. So we'll roll on up here. Look, we're only halfway. That's nice. Get all the way to Strom Camp. Oh, except for when you do something stupid like that. And then slow down your running. Okay, Strom Camp. We're going to sell gems at the market. So. Come, come. Take a look at my wares. What do we have to sell here? Hold on. Let's do this. We're going to look at the map. What is this? It is. Talk to the Peddler's Guild spokesperson. And then what's this? Trade and crafting. Trade and crafting. Okay. Trade and crafting. I don't need to see my paths. I need to know what I have to sell this guy here. I have a, I have a mission to sell him something. Dang it. How do I figure that part out? Trade strong sell four pelts in strong camp. Okay. So four pelts in strong camp. We have all these pelts and they're gonna be Come, come! Take a look at my wares. They're gonna be 111, and we bought them for like, I don't know, 67. What did we buy them for in Garusa? 67. So we're gonna sell that and make our first little bit of profit there. Now he's got one more amber and he's got one more pottery. We're gonna buy those. Pick up his hemp over here. So gems are always good to sell in Strom Cap. Oh, wait a minute. We didn't sell them. Hold on. We want to be lighter weight. We sold him the pelts because that was part of a quest. But what you actually want to sell them here is these. Come, come. So 149 for the gems. Which is significant upgrade from what we bought them for we bought them for let's see we bought them for 90 so uh 150 that's a pretty good markup we're gonna sell those let's see that's worth a chunk of change and now we'll go up to marhan so this is what i was spent what i spent an evening doing on a friday night i wanted to play a game and I've been playing so much of this lately that I wanted to Stand play this, back, but I couldn't peasants. record it. These valuable commodities are only he is refreshed, but he only refreshed three. They always have five gray clusters, but remember we got him on the way out here. So this time he only had enough time to refresh three of those gray clusters. So... But I spent my Friday night doing that. And then I would pick up the occasional uh, contract. And when, you, when you're this level, when you're level 8. Oh, hold on. He's at the border crossing. These guys are going to have great clusters too. Stand back, peasants. Five of them. take those. Commodities are only so when you are level 8 like my group is, basically... And you're going through Tiltron County or Artes or anything. If you pick up a contract to grab a group of people, it's so easy. All you, 
as long as you don't want to capture anybody, all you need to do is find the leader, go smack them over the head. And since Jadruk has this weapon where if he has more strength than them, he automatically crits. He can kill most of them on the first try, on the first hit. It's not even a contest. And the whole rest of the gang will, will want to quit. So that's a really easy way to earn between three and 700 gold pieces is if you can pick up a contract that's that's on the way. So here's Marheim. We're going to turn our contract in. Might she be looking for what we did for trading? Here is your reward. And then we're going to see if there's anything here. So north and northwest, we don't want to go. We want anything that'll go south. Southwest, the Nesbit squad. Okay, maybe that is appropriate. We'll negotiate it. We'll accept the offer. See if it's going to be. And it looks like it's kind of. Is it kind of on the way? Not really, but that's okay. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. We can play here, I think. I'm concerned about the. So it's going to get you like, you know, 65 gold pieces. He's going to get a little more experience. So for that, he gets 70 gold pieces. And we got a sapphire as well and a puzzle. And he's become a journeyman bard. So there's that. But anyway, the important thing here is actually market. Strange. The market doesn't stink quite as much now. I did this offline last episode. I finally figured out what was wrong. There was a there's a place you have to go um, in here, actually, down in the sewers. I missed this the whole time. But if you go down in the sewers, there were some mole rats to kill those. And life is better. I so. would offer wine to go with your cheese. But the disease has. But the disease. So then you talk to this her. This crook has been screaming his head off for days. Now you can I sell the pottery for 98 here. Cart. But I would say don't do that. And the reason is because here's the things that we want to hang on to. Scrolls, silver, pottery, pelts, and amber are all going to be sold at the Brotherhood Training Grounds in our test. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to grab all this silver. Just give me the whole thing here. And we're going to grab all these scrolls and that. And then what do we have here? Amber can be sold for 65 here. We don't... Is this where we... We don't want to sell the amber here either. We're going to take that to the Brotherhood Training Grounds. So we have, we're very, very heavy. We have a lot of food with this. We're going to try to get rid of some of this armor here. So let's do that. So we've grabbed everything that we want right there. Now we're going to go to the forge. I just know this year will be a breeze. Without the vineyards, this. no need to Armor 77 for a ringleader's tabard. Ooh, let's see if that's going to be better on Kira. She's got 95 armor. So that's basically the same thing without... Yeah, and it's she's got all barred in there for, for crit reinforcement. So hers is 37. That'd be... Oh, but she can't do it. It's level 9 required. Okay, hold on. Kira is wearing this, and it's what, level 8 required? Nope, it's level 9 required. It's level 8 required. And did Greet make level 8? She hasn't. Okay, we're going to hang on to this. Because we're going to do that. I'm going to leave it like that. We're going to hang on to this. Level 9. Eh, you know what? I'm going to sell it. It's not worth the wait. It's nice to get... Well, hold on. We're going to do a couple of things here. This is armor 90. This is medium armor. Let's also check if anybody needs this. Xenia's got this, so this armor is, and it's level nine required. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna park this stuff. So right here at the travel post, we haven't done anything with this travel post yet. Okay, let's talk to her. This piece of land is for sale, and it's a great spot for a travel. And as the all-seeing eye's generosity knows no bounds. 
It just so happens that so I for a thousand we can build this one. Let's build it. Do you it, want then. to make the most? Don't worry, your belongings are in good hands. So that changes the situation, and then you get access to this. So the Vertrus travel post. Okay, I want to save this, this, and this helmet, and this fly swatter, and this hunter's headband. Let's see. Greet. What do you got? Because it's range plus one. This is the same range. It's better armor and you get minus one willpower. Okay. We're going to sell that headband then. All right. So there's some things you can, you can do this, you know, make some room, save things here. I got some in the Marheim one as well. I need to get rid of a few more things. Actually, we should put all of our... Acadian steel and gray clusters here for now. An etherite. And we got tons of leather. I'm going to get rid of most of it. So that drops us down below. Okay, now we can properly trade. So there's that. That you can leave companions here and you can manage a garrison. So you can hire some people and leave them here. I need to do some research to figure out if this is necessary. I don't think it is necessary. Now there's this, there's the stewardess. Ah, working here is so refreshing. Marheim craftsmen really know their trade. I placed a chest in which you can store anything weighing you down and a few stools for fighters you'd rather leave behind. If you have other travel posts, I'll gladly arrange trips between them. Where are you off to this time? So travel... And here's the thing, if we want to go to, so we're, if we want to go to Tiltron, it needs supplies and a commodity tax. Man, so you can fast travel, but it's going to cost you money to do so in the triple take 20 hours? Man, I'd rather, I'd rather move it myself. I'm not sure that's worth it. I don't think it is, but having storage is good. So I'm happy with that. So at the three steps market in Marheim... Crook has been we bought her out of everything. Okay. We're going to depart. And the reason I'd like to do the manual travel is because of those gold wagons that we find along the way. And if you can get lucky and get any particular contract here, like here, this one we'd have to go across the bridge and go down here to get. This one you can come here to your strong camp and we can get that one. Uh, you know, there's there's one down here. That's a bunch of contracts. I need to I need to go on a contract cleaning expedition. But this episode's already long. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna finish this up. We got a heck. I got a camp. So I'm gonna camp. We'll finish this up next episode. We'll finish the the whole entire uh, thing. Unless unless we just want to do it this episode. It's not gonna take us that long. Let's do it. Let's finish it this episode. I like that plan a lot better. What is this? This is knowledge, so I need Kira doing it. We have plenty of food. We've made a ton of meals. So let's do one of these big meals. It gets this increased critical damage. This is dexterity and reduces the speed at which the fatigue stacks. This is critical damage increase. This is strength increase. Okay, I'm gonna do one of those. And then feed these hungry bears. All right. So we'll go do this this episode. This will probably take another 10 minutes here. Because we have to make one more quick stop and strom cap. Oh, we got by those pigs. That's a miracle. And we're at 10,667 gold pieces, so... Got to spend money to make money, and I find myself. Oh, what is going on here? I 
find myself spending money on certain things as I go along, like when you find these guys. These guys should have some refresh. Stand back, peasants. It's back to three gray clusters. So here comes Strong Cap. We can stop at the market one more time here and look at him. We don't have gems. We just want to see if he's come, got more come. stuff, and he does. Take a look at my he's ways. got another amber, and he's got another pottery, so we just grab those. And then we depart. Why you can't run through the middle of town, I don't know. Why we have to run through the end of it, I still am baffled by, but... But that's all right. So we have this for trade goods down here. We have amber, scrolls, pottery, silver. The scrolls and the and the silver are the big earners there. Gonna get a lot of gold for those. Same with the rest of it. And any pelts that you bring from Ludern too, but we had to sell our pelts in Strom Camp for a quest. Otherwise, you want to hang on to the pelts as well. They sell really well where we're going. Yeah, because basically at this Brotherhood training ground place down here in Artes, they'll buy almost everything. The gems are the only thing. They actually sell gems there that are kind of cheap. And that's why I was saying um, Cortia has gems here. And that's why you want to take the gems from here and sell them to Strom Camp and kind of go up and back. But other than that, the, the Brotherhood Training Ground will grab everything. So oh, he has gems she again. She probably came across a band of deserters. And he's got pelts They've for 67. We'll be able to sell these pelts for more. The of the war. We're at 939. I'm not... I want to buy his gems, but I'm going to buy them on the way back. Because we're at 968 right now. And I don't want to go over and have to make more food. I just want to be able to rip this off. Because it's the end of this episode, so... So then you don't have to go a whole lot further. You have to go down the road here, right there to the Brotherhood Training Grounds. Which is why it pays to be able to run. And it pays to be able to have those food choices that allow you to let their fatigue not be as great to, to, to stack slower. Up here and then this is also where you can buy books to help the crew out so <laughs> at a minimum everybody really should have especially to go through Lou Dern everybody should have heal and run and then wrath is a nice bonus so you come up here you talk to her those guys over there are rubbish and Completely here's your hopeless. here's your four groups of stuff don't so make the same mistake. silver's gonna sell Learn for the most skills. amber if you don't want to end up like amber it. we bought at Strom Camp for 45 and it's going to sell here for 86 It's not huge. Pottery, we bought um, at Strom Camp for 67 and it's going to sell here for almost twice as much. Really twice as much. So that's a nice boon there. And then the scrolls sell for a massive amount of money. This is 145 And same thing in the silver is the highest, 193 I mean, that's really, really nice. That puts us at 13.404, which is nice. And then you can go through here and you can say, okay, does anybody not have heal? And does anybody not have run? Um, those are the books that I, I like to buy. I like to have run for everybody. First aid for everybody. Let's see. Xenia doesn't have first aid. Okay, we'll buy it for her. And does anybody need wrath? So he's got wrath. He does not have wrath. So that is what I've been doing, like on Friday night. I just made a ton of those runs. 
And then you can go in here and say, Xenia, you need first aid. And then Jadruk, uh, Pete. Pete doesn't have wrath. So he gets that. It's another tool he can play with. And then who needs run? These two guys don't have run. It's a really nice disengagement tool. Xenia has it. Um, Leo Hall does not have it. So we're going to give it to him. This is great for being able to disengage from the plagued ones and get the hell out of there. It's still not ideal. So next episode, since I've got the bears, I'm not going to do any trading right now. I'm just going to head back. We're going to grab gems at this town up here. What is this called? Cortia. I'm going to grab gems at Cortia. I'm going to sell them at Strom Camp. And then we're going to go back to Ludern with all these bears. And we're going to try to do some of the plague ridden stuff in some of those towns. It's a little spooky. I really wish I just had like 12 swordsmen. So we'll see if we can get through it. Folks, thanks as always. You dig it give it a thumbs up subscribe to the channel leave your questions and comments down below now i will see you on the next episode of war tales on the turn base tuesday if you dig it well i said all that stuff i'm just repeating myself now <laughs> thanks for watching everybody until next time happy gaming